Oh, it's finally in. Everything. What's up, YouTube? We back with another one. And uh, what we're doing today is we're going to work at my dad's house. So as you seen last video, we got the transmission and made it up to the engine along with the clutch and everything else. Today, I think what we're gonna do is just um, try, it's cold outside, it's really cold. I don't know if you can see my breath or not, but it's really cold. And But what we're gonna try to do is get a, a, an engine and transmission underneath the car and bolt it up to the car so that's the whole goal for today you know it's not much of a goal but it's gonna be a struggle to just get it to where it's under the car because like I said we don't got a building we don't got concrete we got dirt floor so how we had to do it last time was we had to put it on jacks and when we put it on the jacks what we had to do is like slide it under, under the car with the jacks with the motor transmission on the car with the jacks it's crazy so this time I made sure I recorded it for y'all. You know, I'm, I made sure I'm going to record it for y'all. That way y'all can see and, you know, be alone for the ride. The way from everywhere from the first start, from the motor getting there in the car. I didn't get to record like the motor being built because like, it was such ratty and then it was getting built along the time that I had my kid. And uh, so I didn't really get to film none of it, which is okay. But from here on out, anything I do to it, I'll be able to film. So that's that's good. So that's the uh, plans for today. So we're about to head over there now, and uh, I'll cut y'all back home when we get over there. Transmission all together and got the clutch in and everything. Well, now it's time to put the motor in the car. So we're gonna have to jack it up with the motor stand. Then we're gonna have to run. We got some tins over there. We have to run the tins over here all the way to the car. That way, when we jack this up, we can slide the motor right in there bolted up to where it'd be sitting under its own weight or we don't got to do anything else and we just start hooking the wiring up all the piping and everything and everything button up for the first start so that'll probably be the next video is the first start so y'all make sure you stay tuned but i'll put y'all on a time lapse of us picking up the motor and going over here yeah i know
So as you can see, the motor is pretty much under the car. It's not all the way in there yet, or under its own weight. But next, what we gotta do is we're gonna pull all this wiring out like, to the side like it is now, probably a little bit more, and try to finesse it in because you can see the power steer pump and all that and the uh, brake, or the power steering pump and everything, the AC condenser and stuff, or the AC pump is down there. And it's kind of lodging it up. There was a bracket down there that my dad had to take off. And it's back there that holds the transmission up or onto the cross member right there. And uh, it, it was in the way and it was kind of holding us up. So now what we're about to do is we're about to try to you know, finesse it in there. We'll probably have to take this off um, the front once we get it a little bit more in there. And then we'll start jacking up the motor to where we can start bolting stuff up to where it'll be under its own weight. And then, um, once it's on there, I'll, uh, I'll cut y'all back on and show y'all, um, you know, it holding under its own weight. And, you know, just talk to y'all about the process of doing it because, man, that was a little, it's, it's been rough. <laughs> it's been hard trying to get it um, up under there, for sure, especially without the concrete being on the dirt. But uh, we're going to get it under there and I'll cut y'all back on. Everything's finally in under its own weight. Got all the motor mounts in. Even trans mounts on, cross member, everything. Down pipes, kinda hooked up. He's about to put the bracket on now. We'll be finished. The jump was not easy. <laughs> uh, we had to cram it in there, kinda sorta. But it's in there now, so we finished. All right, y'all. That's the end of this video. I appreciate all y'all watching. I hope y'all y'all subscribe, uh, like, comment what y'all think about the caliber so far. Y'all think it's gonna sound good, or you know, how y'all think the build's gonna go with it too. So I know it's kind of crazy because I got two builds going on at one time, but that's just the way things happen. So comment what y'all think. But we next video we should be on, um, you know, trying to keep buttoning everything up getting closer to that first start. I'm hoping first start will be in the next video. It just depends on how long it runs out. The whole video runs out and everything. But uh, hopefully we'll get that first start in the next video. And I'm sorry that uh, y'all was on a bunch of time lapse this time. But you know, it's kind of hard to work and get things done and just trying to explain everything when it's really self-explanatory. You really can't explain it. But um, I appreciate everyone one of y'all for watching like comment subscribe like i said um, we about to go up this year y'all stay tuned peace